Now, look, everybody that's screaming that they're against anti-Semitic, blah, 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 blah. We're going to need that energy once we provide you with the recap at the end. Okay, buddies? The Bible says so. Damn, well, hey, right? Right? The real Jews are going to slave or slave shit. Does that fit your history? Not that I care. Exactly, because you're not a real Jew. Right. Hey, right. You got into that land in 1948 That's by the right. Balfour Declaration. In 1948 by the, by the United you Nations. Am I right? Yeah. Yeah. The, the way you got into the land for Israel today is because of 1948. That's correct. Exactly. So you're not a real Jew. Right. England placed y'all in that land. The United Nations placed y'all in that land. You're not a Jew. Exactly. You're not a Jew. You're a convert. Okay. You're red. You're an Esau. Right. You, you ever heard of Esau in the Bible? No. No? Yes, you have. Your father is Esau. That's right. That's the white race. You're That's Esau. Right. You're not a Jew. Are you Our father. No, I'm anti everything, not Jesus. That's right. right. We're, we're, my lineage is Jacob. Your lineage is Esau. No, no, I that's know that's the you have, man. Now, first and foremost, the Jewish faith, people, all of that's based out of biblical. Everybody with us so far, right? Now, everybody in the Bible that matters, that really matters, the characters in the Bible, this color darker. They were black people. Skin of bronze, hair of wool, even Jesus. That was his description. And at that time frame, chronologically, geographically, people look like this much darker more than likely just because of nature and this that and the third now those jewish people were the actual jewish people when you talk about the exodus that no one can prove where but the hieroglyphics show people that were allegedly enslaved again no one can prove either way though but the the the, the, the hieroglyphics that are still this color not the ones that they've restor had restoration on right where they touched them up and made them almost like this the bust of nefertiti right 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 those were the jewish people the people that occupy what is Israel now, that didn't exist before 1948, are the same people that fled Nazi Germany that were this color that took on the name Jewish. Right now, what we need you to think about is Rachel Dolezal. Now, let's say Rachel Dolezal didn't get outed for actually being a white woman, but she met a black, a white man that was also presenting as black. They have kids, they raise those kids, and there's a collective of them, and they get all amassed together, and they're all claiming black, but they keep themselves intermingling within these families. That M. Night Shalomar movie where they had, they were hiding in Central Park, by the way, which used to be a black neighborhood that was a race massacre, and now became Central Park, that nobody's talking about giving that back, even though y'all talk about Black Wall Street all week, and still forgot the move movement on its anniversary, right? Not the point, not the point not the point that's what the jewish people are in israel right now they're people that took the jewish title and attached it to the biblical references of people who look like this but they're colonizers they're white folks in jewish face and then when hitler went to abuse them and annihilate them and use them as the scapegoat for their problems everyone heard jewish and said they've been experiencing this since biblical times and so the heart felt emotions of all the access that went against hitler and whatnot to get this madman out of place and it wasn't because of the Jews, no, no, no. Because Hitler was preaching world domination, master race, Aryans, da, da, da. He was threatening regular old white folks. And that's their money, that's their existence. This is what Hitler was threatening. He, it wasn't because he was killing white folks. It helped. It made it easier because think about this. When's the last time the United States military went in to free anybody that wasn't white? And if you say Juneteenth, you're lying because the only reason the military went in there on Juneteenth is to stop the enslaved and the natives that they couldn't tell the difference from. We're gonna say this again. The indigenous people that called themselves, they were calling them Indians, and the runaway slaves, they could not discern between the two groups of people. Now, if you can't tell the difference between the two groups of people, then that means those two groups of people looked exactly alike. It's kind of like the story of Moses. He couldn't have been Pharaoh's son, brought up to the people, and not look like Pharaoh, and nobody said nothing about it. <clears throat> we digress. Now, if these white folks in Israel are not real Jews, but they're claiming the Jewish title to hide behind, that's anti-Semitic. It's the same thing as someone just popped up like, oh, Rachel Dozell and said that she was black and she's not black. That's not real. So when you make this whole thing about people talking down on the Jewish people, talking about Israel, da 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 da, those people aren't being anti-Semitic. They're keeping truth in order. They, they're keeping up with what you want, the truth. That's what you are, all you people. There's so much fake information. Those fake Jews, which are the Khazars, they're gypsies. Not to be confused with the gypsies like from the Romanian and the Bulgarian and that mix of people that really were traveling nomadic groups or whatnot, the Italians in some cases too. Not to be confused with those gypsies, the Khazars, they're white folk, they're not Jews. So speaking against those people isn't anti-Semitic. The people here, the Hasidic, Hasidic kid, whatever they call them, the, the, the other fake Jew, those are not Jews. Those are people who adopted a faith. They're not really Jews. So just to clear that up, so when y'all want to come out here and be like, we're anti, we're anti, anti-Semitism, then you need to be against the fake Jews. Anywho, you should know the drill by now. Like this, comment to add value. Send this to your people. Follow this account. Good talk. Glad we had it. R E X.